What's up Cloud Clan? I'm Clouded and welcome to episode 24 of our Pokemon Heart Gold Randomizer Clan Lock. In the last episode, we made it here to Blackthorn City, finally in the last uh, city where the gym is. Uh, the final gym is. And we caught a few Pokemon along the way. Nothing too great that I would really want to uh, share. But if you are interested in that, go watch the last episode. Uh, let's go over our team before we begin. Leading off, we have Whimsical Level 38, holding the Amulet Coin with Mega Drain, Aromatherapy, Stun Spore, and Poison Powder. Glicks all at level 36, we picked up a Never Melt Ice in the last episode, and uh, she's got Icy Wind, Shadow Ball, Confuser, and Double Team. Katie is at level 36 with Strength, Fake Out, Crunch, and Drain Punch. Snow is at level 38 with Quick Claw, and has Surf, Mudshot, Rock Team, we also found the HM for Waterfall. Uh, Star 6 level 35 with Flamethrower, Curse, Rapid Spin, and Body Slam. So that is our team. We can just uh, go ahead and explore around the town a little bit. Is there an invisible item up here? No. Oh no, I didn't want to take a picture. You've got a nice picture. Thanks. Thanks, man. Dragonair's cube, I don't have it. Would you trade your no? Why did I trade Dragonair for Dodrio? Your vile plume needs to work a little harder. If it does, I'll give you a quick one second. Wow, are you saying? Are you saying my Vile Plume is not a hard worker? Really? Really? Clan of trainers who can freely command dragon type Pokemon lives right here in Blackthorn. As a result, there are many legends about dragons in this town. Move to leader. Alright, we don't need to go in there at the moment. Nice little ledge right there. You, sir. Those trainers called Dragon Tamers are all... Okay, yeah. They're all from Blackthorn City. Claire, our gym leader, is waiting for you. However, it would be impossible for a run-of-the-mill trainer to win. We're already... She's already accepting... Okay. Um... Just kind of scout the levels, then. I don't think we go to the Dragon's Inn yet, can we? We could have had a Mew here! Instead we caught a Barboach. Yeah, he can't, he won't let us in. Really? We could have had a Mew. We get a Barboach. Ampharos are here too. Wow. And sh I'm done. I'm done with this place. I'm done with this place. I'm done with this place. Let's go in. Yo, champ in the making! The gym has unstable footing. Keep your Pokemon in their Pokeballs now. Claire uses the mythical and sacred Dragon-type Pokemon. You can't damage them very easily, but you know, they're supposed to be weak against Ice-type moves. And Dragon. And Dragon. I, oh yeah, I remember this gym. Let's take you on! Your first battle against dragons, I'll show you how tough they are. Okay, show me some dragons. Level 35, okay. Do not protect. Slam, no. Stop protecting. Grand Bull, that is fine. Intimidate Grand Bull, okay. Roar into snow. Well, you just messed up. And your last Pokemon is a Thai Rogue. We don't have any flying or psychic types because we cannot catch psychic types because they don't like us. Psychic don't want us to catch them. Let's get going to Sarsic. Get some flamethrowers going and take out this Thai Rogue. How are we looking? We're looking alright. Dragons are sacred Pokemon. They're full of life energy. If you're not serious, you won't be able to beat them. That's a, that's a good dragon right there. That's a scary dragon. Signal beam. Oh, not bad. But barrel. Okay, that's fine. We can drain punch you all day. Alright, let's see. This needs to go... Uh... 
we need to go that yeah we need to go that way oh turn that down now we have to turn again not that way uh, no other way shoot that way there we go haha -ha. it's not as if we all use dragon type Pokemon it's more about, it's about more than that we're just we're interested in strong Pokemon that's my theme show me your strong Pokemon cyclist Joe Chinchar very strong 37 outrage I don't want it. Getting locked into that could be bad. Geodude. Very strong. See ya. I've been training hard with Claire. There's no way I can lose. Cricketune, really? Get bodied. My chance of losing not even 1%, more like 100. Ooh, get, get a patters out of here. No, come on. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, we woke up good. All right, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Stop putting me to sleep. I don't want your bad dreams. All right, we got to heal. Let's go. Hyper Potion. And full heal. Or we have an awakening. Let's go full heal. Another faint attack. Let's heal up again. Puts us back to sleep. Can you stop landing? Hypnosis. Drain punch. Goodbye, Dark Rye. Is this the last one? I think it might be the last one. Not quite high enough though. Oh, ouch. Hmm. Oh, well, that works. All right, so here's Claire. Um I think we should be alright as long as we just get everyone up to full health. So let's use super potions. One for you. One for you. And Starzik should be alright. Alright, let's go. Let's go, Claire. I am Claire, the world's best dragon type master. I can hold my own against even the Pokemon League's Elite Four. Do you still want to take me on? Fine, let's do this. As a gym leader, I'll use my full power against any opponent. Alright, Claire. Anne. Anne. Cop Anne. Bonsley. <laughs> Level 38. Rock team. Alright, we'll take it. And down goes the Bonsly. Pineco. Okay, that's fine. Uh, even if you do want to explode, uh, Sarsic is going to eat it up. Spikes! I see you setting up. Claire, do you want this to be a long match? Because that's what it seems to me. But your Pineco is dead. Mamoswine. Alright, Snow. 
You got this. You're both the same level. Let's go for the waterfall. Hail. Okay. We can uh, we can dig the hail. Then this waterfall is almost going to one shot this mammoth swine. Goes for the hyper potion and takes another waterfall. Why am I speeding up so much? I don't know. This is an important battle. Don't speed up. All right. So we're gonna take some more hail damage. Maybe our quick claw can come off right here? No. It's an ice fang off that's neutral. We should eat it up though, because we're defensive. We take that very well and get a waterfall off. We're gonna take out this mammoth swine and she's gonna have one Pokemon left. And what is it, Claire? What is your last Pokemon gonna be? Snow's gonna go to level 39. And wants to learn muddy water, but uh, we're not going to uh, learn that. Don't give up. Okay. No, I don't want it. Give up. Okay. And Grumpig is your last Pokemon, so that's perfect because it's hailing. We got Snow Cloak. Nice and Snow Cloak. Her the spikes. And Grumpig is her ace at level 41. One Pokemon left. This is where the real battle begins. And we're gonna get a Shadow Ball off. This should do a good amount of damage. Takes that pretty well. Can we get the defense drop? Nope. We don't get a special defense drop. We come in as Zen Headbutt at us. How much is this gonna do? Not too much. He's gonna get buffeted by the, the hail. I'm gonna heal up right here just to play it safe. And he'll take some more hail damage. And maybe we can kill him off with one more shadow ball. Oh, but it, she's gonna go for the rest. She's gonna go for the rest. Which is, oh, the hail stops, lovely. I'm fine with you going for the rest though because now we can get a few, or hopefully a few, or three, is it three turns? That was a crit glix, wow. So uh, that Grumpig is pretty much done for now. You're kidding, right? I'm supposed to win. I already decided. Well, you don't get to decide everything. You got a full restore. That's fine. Do we get special defense drop? We do get the special defense drop! Glix is getting all the hacks right now. So this actually might kill. Since we got that drop, I think it will. And down goes the Grumpig. Nice job, Glix. Putting Claire in her place. I lost? I don't believe it! There must be some mistake! She's such a sore loser. I won't concede this! I might have lost, but you're still not ready for the Pokemon League. I know. You should take the Dragon Master Challenge. Behind this gym is a place called Dragon's Den. There's a small shrine at its heart. Go there. If you can prove that you've lost your lazy ideals, I'll admit you are a, wor you are a trainer worthy of a gym badge. So no gym badge for us. Yet. And I just realized something that, uh... I'm gonna have to make... What does Todd want? Cloud, howdy, it's Todd, how are you? You must be a lot better now, huh? How about showing me your technique in a real battle with me? I'll be waiting on Route 34. Okay, Todd. So we can get an encounter in the Dragon's Den. And as I was saying before, I need to make the Kanto badges. Uh, and I think I'm just gonna move the Johto badges like to the side a little bit and make them, maybe shrink them down a little bit just to show that we still have them. But, uh, I'll figure that out, uh, whenever I do that. Whenever that'll be. Fairly soon-ish. Probably after packs, though. So now we can go into the Dragon's Den. Whew. We, we have to get something good down here. If we don't, I'm gonna be so upset. You, how dare you enter uninvited. Hey, Claire told me to come here. Tyranitar! Fine by me because uh, we've got Drain Punch. You're four times weak to Drain Punch. You still you still ate that pretty well though. And that did a good chunk of damage. Wow. We we'll go to level 38. All right. I want to surf. I want to surf. Watch. We're gonna get a crap encounter, and then we're gonna encounter a nice psychic type. Always happens. Ooh! A 
A Porygon Z? That is nice. Granted, it's level 12, but... That thing has power behind it. And it has Psychic type attack. So that's good also. So uh, we cannot attack it because we are way too high of a level for that thing to take any hits. So we're going to have to chuck some uh, Pokeballs at it and hope we can catch it. Alright, Porygon Z. Gets another Psybeam. I'm going to just go ahead and switch out. Actually, no, we're taking those fine. We don't need to switch out really. You know what? Let's go ahead and use this Premier Ball and see if you want to be the special catch. Do you want to be the special catch? Okay. Well, let's go back to throwing great balls until we run out. Ho hopefully we don't run out because then I start to get a little worried we're not going to catch it. That'd be really bad. Alright. Another side beam. We take that just fine. You guys like that? I don't know if you can see it on the, on the webcam, but I, it might be cut off. I don't know if you can see the little derpy Bulbasaur. Just in case you can't, I'll just pull him up into... Look at his face, it's so funny, and he's like so... Nasty plot! Okay, well that's a little scary. That's a little scary, but that's also pretty nice that we see that on you. Um, I'm gonna play it safe. And use a super potion. Oh, we still take that really well. Just try throwing some more great balls at you. Another nasty plot. You gotta calm down. Ah. Makes me think of the Glaze stream we had a couple days ago. There are some of those legendary Pokemon are pretty uh, adamant about being caught. They just didn't want to stay in the ball. And if you guys did miss the stream, and uh, if you want to watch parts of it, I did upload it. It's like four hours long, so it's it's lengthy, but it's there if you guys want to watch watch some of it. And it was a lot of fun, and there will be another one, which will be after PAX sometime. Because we did not catch all the legendaries yet in Glazed. So hopefully some more of you guys can come out. Because even though we had, we had a decent amount of people... But uh, it was still fun, nice to uh, talk with you guys that were there. Since Porygon Z will stay in the ball, that'd be cool. I he is setting up like crazy. What is he, plus six special attack, he's got some agilities. I mean, if Falls fails, we could stall out his PP until he struggles himself down some. I might do that if we run out of Great Balls, to be honest. He does not want to stay in the ball. I don't know how much PP... Oh, we caught him! Awesome, 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 awesome. That is nice, that is nice, that is nice. That's a good catch. That's a good catch. Its programming was modified to enable it to travel through alien dimensions. It seems there might have been an error. Huh. Alright, so let me just go look on the YouTubes. Alright, so no new ones on the last episode. Let's go to the one before that. Episode 21. Because I haven't recorded... Uh... Okay, no new ones on that. Uh, let's try 20. Ah, oh, Christian commented on it. Mr. Faint Attacks. Mr. Faint Attacks commented on this video. So, uh, I'm going to call you. Will Faint Attacks fit? I don't think it will. A-T-T-A. No, it's not going to fit. Let's just call you Christian. Christian! Thanks for leaving a comment a couple episodes ago. 
I'm pretty sure you're going to PAX too, so if you're watching, I'm I'm looking forward to meeting you. As well as a lot of other people. There's Miss Drevis in here also. Uh, I'm just, I just like to scout out what uh, what's in the areas. A bunch of Porygon Zs. Ours did not have that uh, ability though. The uh, download. Unfortunately. So there's just Mistrevis and uh, Porygon Z in here. There has to be something else, right? Maybe. Do one more. All right, we'll just get out of here. Uh, can you encounter stuff like right here? Maybe not. Found the calcium. So I want to check out uh, our Porygon Z. It's a timid nature. Holy crap. It has adaptability. If we get tri attack on this thing, it's all over. This thing could set up and sweep, literally. If we keep nasty plot agility and then like tri attack and then something else, this this thing could be a monster. But I'm not going to add it to the party just now. I do really, really want to use it, though. At some point, we need to use that thing. Because that thing is going to put in a lot of work. Wow. Adaptability. I'd rather have adapt adaptability than download, to be honest. I seem to see about getting Tri-Attack on it. I don't know if it can learn it by level up, or if it can't, maybe we can hopefully get it uh, the Move Tutor to t re relearn it. Or is it the mover learner? Yeah, that dude. That dude there. But yeah, this thing. And uh, that that's actually really lucky that we caught it as a Porygon Z. Because uh, both of Porygon's evolutions require trade. So that is actually... Wow. That's amazing. Um, let's see, just take a look at our team real quick. We're sitting alright, we're sitting alright. Let's go back in here and deal what we gotta deal with. I'm still curious about um, when we go back to catch ho -Oh, if it's going to be randomized or not. Because we did run into Raikou and Entei and they were not randomized. So I'm hoping that uh, the legends are all randomized because they, sh they should be. I'm pretty sure. Let's have a battle. Oak, go away. I'm gonna get off with Sarsic because uh, Sarsic is the lowest level right now. You shouldn't be in here. You're gonna take this flame. Don't you flatter me, okay? Don't flatter me. Mankey, that's fine. Seismic Toss is not, though. And Sarsic's level 36. She wants to learn Protect. Nah. Glam meow. Let's just flamethrower you. I'm gonna double battle down here. I did not mean to fish, but uh... Centret. Okay, I'm glad we didn't fish. What else could we have caught, though? Some more Centret. I don't know if you guys like watching like what else I could have caught, but it's really fun for me just to see what else there is. Even though I usually get <laughs> upset at what I see. Uh, and I'm like, man, we could have had this instead of that. Are there just a bunch of Sintrets in here? Pineco. Nope. Alright, so... No! I don't want my rod out. Um, that's fine lead, I guess. It's a stranger, someone we don't know. Who are you? Ooh. Flamethrower, Breloom, and Icy Wind both. A Breloom. Yo, turn down. That was close. Ice Shard. Uh, let's just get rid of double team. 
And let's flamethrower. And Icy Wind. Yes, we will follow you and you will go bye bye I'm gonna switch Sarsic out. Huey, stop! I don't like you. You're so annoying, Huey. Actually, Sarsic is still the lowest level, so uh, I'm just gonna use a Hyper Potion on her. Got a Max Elixir. Did we get Whirlpool? I think we have Whirlpool. Hopefully. Hopefully. Okay, yes, we do have Whirlpool, but I don't want to have to have our Swampert learn it. So, I'm just gonna go back and get a slave real quick. I know some people are against getting uh, Pokemon that are HM slaves that, um, like, if you have a Pokemon in your party that can learn Whirlpool, then you're supposed to, but, um, that's not, that's not how I prefer to play. Uh, if, if there's something, um, I don't know what I'm trying to say, uh, there are certain things that I will not switch out for, but uh, not in something like this. So I'm sure Croconaw can learn Whirlpool. There we go. Katie can learn Whirlpool too. And let's get rid of Scary Face. Alright. So we got... Oh, wait, was that Volistair that I took out? The crocodile? Yeah, it was. Uh, he was at the stream. So, uh, we need a whirlpool through here. No, I didn't want to go back out. Alright, let's get through these whirlpools now. And see what's on the other side. Can you stop? Well, what was that? I kept going for a cover. Alright, I'm throwing on repel. <laughs> uh, super repel will work fine. Yeah, we gotta get the whirlpool going. I'm on the wrong side. Alright. Well, this there used Whirlpool. It's so slow when you go through those Whirlpool. Is there anything back here? Is there really nothing back here? There's an item up there. I'm going to grab that really quick. It's a dragon fang. That's pretty cool. Oh no, Porygon Z, stop! <sighs> Throwing on another repel. Because uh, Sartek's too slow. Alright, so we are here. Oh, good to see you here. No need to explain why you came. Claire sent you here, didn't she? That girl is a handful. I'm sorry, but I must test you, not to worry. You are to only answer a few questions. Ready? What are Pokemon to you? Friend. Oh, I understand. What helps you to win battles? Strategy. Oh, I understand. What kind of trainer do you wish to be? Anyone. I understand. What's most important for raising a Pokemon? Love. I understand. Strong Pokemon, weak Pokemon. Which is more important? Both. You care deeply for Pokemon. Very commendable. That conviction is what is important. Cloud, don't lose that belief. I, I, I will see you through at the Pokemon League. Here she comes. So how did it go? I guess there's no point in asking. You did fail. What? You passed? That can't be! You're lying. Even I have been approved. Claire, this child is impeccable in skill and spirit. Admit defeat and confer the rising badge. Oh, must I inform Lance of this? Uh, I understand. Here, here's the rising badge. Hurry up, take it. There we go. We got our final badge for the Johto region. That is nice. 
The Rising Badge will enable your Pokemon to use the move for climbing waterfalls. Also, all Pokemon will know you as a trainer and obey your every command without question. Claire, reflect upon what it is that you lack and this child has. She's so upset. By the way, have you heard of Lugia? Oh wait, is it Lugia in this game we catch? No. It's gold, wait, what? Or do we can we catch both? I don't remember, it's been so long. There's some Pokemon that do have lived around World Islands once. Uh, never mind. Just mad words of the old. Ah. It's been quite some time since the trainer has gained our master's rare approval. In fact, not since Master Lance. You know young Master Lance? He looks so much like our master did in his youth. It's in their blood. Oh. Someone's just holding something. Would you like to take it? What? Why are you holding a black beard? What? <laughs> Alright, so can we escape rope out of here? Let's get up out. Elm, chill. Hello, Claude. How's it going? I've got a uh, hold of something neat. Swing back by my lab and pick it up. Okay, cool. No, I didn't want to call mom. Chill, chill, mom. No. So, uh, this has been a pretty good episode. We caught that amazing Porygon Z with a timid nature and adaptability. I could not complain about that at all. Whew. We had a little bit of turn of luck with our, our captures, so. Let's go ahead and put Volustair back in here for now. Thank you for using our Whirlpool, little buddy. And that's where I'm going to end it off here. So, if you guys enjoyed today's episode of our Pokemon Heart Gold Randomizer Clan Lock, please remember to leave a like, comment, and maybe even subscribe if you haven't already to become part of the Cloud Clan. That'd be greatly appreciated, and I will see you next time.